Hey everyone! Today I've got a product review of the Xneedo e-bike helmet. The founder of Xneedo contacted me and asked me if I wanted to do a review on this helmet. So if after watching this video you decide you want to get one of these, please use my affiliate link at the end. Um, you'll get 10% off the purchase and you'll get free shipping if you're in the United States or Canada. So this helmet is part of the old school collection, what they're calling it. It comes in a variety of colors. You can see those on their website. Um, it's designed specifically for the higher speeds associated with the electric vehicles like uh, e-bikes, e-scooters, uh, the electric skateboards, um, pretty much anything you can think of that uh, has the higher speeds. This particular helmet is a foam core with an outer shell, um, very similar to your standard bike helmet. But this one is actually rated, it's a class three helmet, rated for higher speeds. So a standard bike helmet isn't gonna do you a whole lot of good if you're doing 30 miles an hour on your e-bike down the road and end up uh, hitting your head. Um, specifically what this is designed for. So I think this helmet is a really great solution for bridging the gap between a standard bicycle helmet and a motorcycle helmet. Um, these just don't have the protection that you're going to need uh, riding the electric vehicles at the higher speeds. And I've seen a lot of people wearing full-on motorcycle helmets and that is not a bad decision either. Um, the full face is definitely nice. So for me, the downside of wearing an actual motorcycle helmet is that they weigh quite a bit more. Uh, they can be real hot, especially in the summertime. And you look a little bit more like a motorcyclist than a bicyclist. So that's something that I don't always want uh, to look like a motorcyclist because I'm often riding in state parks, national parks, that kind of thing. And I want to look more like a bicyclist than like I'm breaking the law riding a motorcycle on the back trails. So this helmet can take higher impacts and it's got some cool safety features as well. So one of the safety features that you immediately notice with this helmet is that it's got built-in lights both for back and front here. We've got a white LED on the front and a red LED on the back. Um, it's a really nice safety feature. I've been using it for the past couple of weeks here. Uh, anytime I'm on the road. So this light, although you can see it pretty well here, um, it doesn't show up really well on a bright sunny day, but in low light conditions, um, it's extremely bright. You've got options between just a flash, a solid, or I believe they're calling this a fade. It kind of fades in and out. You can turn that back off. So when you turn this on, no matter what mode you're in on the back, your headlight is on. The lights charge off a USB port. Uh, takes about two to three hours from dead to a full charge. And the lights seem to last about 10 hours. So just last week I wore this helmet camping and it was really ideal for that. I ended up doing quite a bit of road riding to get where I needed to camp. So it was really nice to have the uh, safety feature of the flashing light on the back. I was riding in some pretty heavy traffic through part of that. And then once I got to the campsite, um, this front light was really handy in low light conditions. I didn't have to take my uh, small headlamp with me because I had this. Um, I could see this being very useful, uh, like when you're commuting and rolling up after dark kind of thing, locking up your bike, all that should be able to see what you're doing without needing the addition of an, another light. So the adjusters in this helmet are very nice. Um, on a lot of road bike, mountain bike helmets, you've got this sort of adjuster where it's, it's a pinch um, so you kind of just squeeze these together to adjust in and out. 
um, which works fine on these kind of helmets. Uh, but this is much more like a sort of a hard hat design. So you've got a huge amount of adjustment here with the main strap. Uh, the padding's nice. So one of the things I really like about this helmet that make it very easy to get on and off is it's got this slide buckle here. So that just slides and connects. So the actual strength of the buckle is in these two nylon pieces, but it goes together very easily and is held together by actual magnets within. So it doesn't rely on the magnets for strength, but it's just makes it very simple and easy to, to put on. And so that's really nice. Um, this is actually easy to strap, even when you're wearing full finger gloves and all. This visor here, you can run it with or without. It's just a, a fabric. So you can just run it as a normal helmet without. I kind of like the visor. It's, it's like having a, a ball cap. The uh, adds a little bit of a build to the front. And I do like the look of that. Like I said, I've been wearing it for a couple of weeks now on my daily rides and on my camping trip as well. And really liked it. Um, very comfortable helmet. This helmet is actually more comfortable than what I've been wearing. So it's been really nice to have that on. Let's check the weight here. I know they say it weighs less than a pound. Let's see where we're at. 14.1 ounces. So the day glow colors are just so visible. So my suggestion to Exnito would be to provide this type of helmet where this lower color is one of the day glow colors. Um, just for more visibility. We're just always looking for safety, always looking to be seen out there. If people see you, um, they're so much more likely to give you the room you need and not have to and not have close calls. So another big selling point for this helmet is that Exnito offers an accident replacement policy on the helmet. Um, if you damage the helmet, in a crash, they will replace it for free. Um, you can't beat that. And because of that, this may very well be the last helmet that you ever have to buy. But overall, a great helmet. Uh, thank you, Ben, for sending me this. So I do have an affiliate link on this helmet and please use that link. It'll give you 10% off the purchase and you will get free shipping in the United States and Canada. Again, thank you for watching and ride safe.